On Saturday, November the 4th, we lost a great man, husband, dad, grandpa, pop. My idea is to create a video diary of sorts to help me along with my healing. And if it helps someone out there somewhere that just happens to come across these, even better. I'm not saying it's going to be professional or maybe even consistent or comprehensive, coherent, whatever big words you want to use. It may be a big mess, but it's something. Hey, Dad. Good morning. Today is Monday, December the 11th. Um, I just dropped off Chunk at the bus stop and Mom at work. Um, and yeah, I did not make a video yesterday. It's been a busy weekend. Um, uh, we finally went back to the grocery store. <laughs> Going early in the morning anyway. It wasn't even that, that early. I just, uh, like I said, it's been such a busy weekend. <sighs> we left like an hour later than we usually do. So it was like seven already. <laughs> but yeah. We haven't really been needing too much as far as groceries, so we haven't really been going like we used to. I mean, we still have eggs and milk and bread and, you know, veggies and fruits, the basics, so. And then, you know, usually we would go so that mom could get, like, your favorite stuff to eat and whatnot. So we hadn't really had a, a dire need <laughs> to go. But we finally went yesterday. So, yeah. I don't know if I'll be making videos on Sundays. Maybe sometimes not on Saturdays either. I guess depending on how busy we are. We're trying to stay. It's exhausting. <laughs> but, yeah, I have so much to tell you and so little time because I have to start getting ready soon I am leaving early today from work I have a doctor's appointment which I'm kind of nervous about I haven't been to a like doctor's doctor's appointment in like years and years and years you know but mom said I have to I well, I mean I should anyway after the emergency room stay, but, you know, she made sure, <laughs> like, over my shoulder, making sure I made an appointment, so I'm going to go today, so that means I have to get there on time, because I have to leave early, and so, yeah, there's that, I'm kind of nervous about that, poor Nunu hurt his foot this weekend as well. <clears throat> Frito says he was like jumping off the stairs. You know how he does. Like when he jumps off chairs and stairs and stuff like that. And he ended up hurting his heel. But they're having a hard time. Because you know. He didn't like the. Excuse me. The bandage. That they put on his foot. And I think he has to get a cast. Mom was saying. But she's not sure. Because. She says she doesn't understand <laughs> what Frida was telling her, but either way, um, they're having issues with her, with him, sorry. Um, and so I think that makes her anxious, which in turn, she, I don't know, I kind of want to say takes it out on me, I don't know, because just everything everything she has to nitpick with me about or has to complain about or just uh, has something to say and I don't know so I was pretty grouchy with her this weekend I know I shouldn't but golly even <laughs> even with just something simple like parking the car we were trying to park at H-E-B and there was an officer, you know, in the way of a parking spot. And so I was like, okay, 
Well, I started looking around for another parking spot. But the officer decided, you know, to back up and free up that space. But they were still, like, right there. And I was like, mm, I didn't park there after all. And she got all frustrated. I'm like, it's a parking spot. That's really what made me go over the edge. <laughs> I was like really, really frustrated, you know. But anyway, that's neither here nor there. Um, so the, yeah, they're not gonna be going on with their vacation after all. And I was like a little mean about it. I was like, Great, now I don't get a break. <laughs> Because, you know, like I said, I was getting really grumpy with her. She was just... <sighs> but I know I have to have patience. Because we're all exhausted. <laughs> we're all mentally just and physically just drained from, <clears throat> you know, trying to live, basically live our lives <laughs> um, but yeah I'm sure there was more oh mm, yeah last yesterday last night whatever we took a uh, chunk and his friends to main event to uh, celebrate you know his birthday that just passed a bit ago and so that was pretty fun. It was a long night or evening day. We started at four. That's when we got there. We didn't leave till like after ten. Yeah, I was so tired, and then I had laundry to do. Oh, I didn't get to sleep till like one o'clock in the morning. It was tiring, but it was fun for you know the boys. Um. Uh, I think like one or two of the friends couldn't make it. So we took, you know, Bean and he got to join the big boys. <laughs> it was so cute when they would take pictures. It'd be like the three tall boys and then little Bean. <laughs> but yeah, they seemed to have fun. Bean ended up losing his little game card that had all his points or whatever. They were like shopping around for the prizes. And somehow, somewhere in there, he lost it. And we looked and looked and looked, and we never did find it. So, of course, he was upset and crying because now he didn't have any prizes, you know? He didn't have any points. And so, he, they started bowling, and you know Claudia. She loves to take care of those boys. She ended up going to buy another card, and, and um, she sat there, and she played, and she played. She's like... What are the games that will give us the most points? So, mm -hmm. we, she ended up getting the prizes that he had already picked out. and He was so happy. And I was telling him, I was like, you better tell her thank you and you better give her a big old hug. She is one of the best moms because I would have been like, you lost it too bad. <laughs> now, I don't think I would have because I felt pretty bad that he was crying too. But, yeah, I told him. I was like, I would have I would have just left you with no prizes. <laughs> but anyway, I should probably get going and get ready. Like I said, I have to leave early, so I have to make sure I get there on time. But all right, Dad, you take care. You get some rest and try not to worry about us too much. <laughs>